it's already a history that Belarus participates in the international exp expositions like Expo as a separate pavilion because we would like to bring more information about the country, about our achievements, about people of Belarus and the beauty of our country. Uh, in uh, at Expo 2020, it was a special decision because because we have special relations with the United Arab Emirates. It is a history of uh, long-standing official contacts between the two countries, trade cooperation, investment projects happening in Belarus with, uh, with the participation of the companies and investors from the United Arab Emirates. For me personally, it's, it's, it's another occasion because 20 years ago I was uh, among the team who started first Belarus embassy here in, in the United Arab Emirates and now I am as a Commissioner General have additional pleasure to open our national pavilion to, to show new possibilities uh, of our country and possibly discuss new possi new uh, areas of cooperation between the two countries. Uh, as I mentioned, uh, we have many achievements in Belarus and in parallel we have a very beautiful country with beautiful nature. So we decided to, to thematically call our pavilion the forest of future, of future technologies. At the moment, uh, everyone who is coming to Belarus as a tourist can enjoy the nature. At the same time, we are a very developed uh, industrial country, very developed agricultural country. Many, many people in the world know Belarus as a high-tech uh, park in, in, the, in the center of Europe. So that is why we decided to, to show uh, the fusion of nature and uh, future technologies. And if you follow the, the exposi exposition, you will see that we are trying to, to present our industries, our scientific and research potential, and at the same time uh, show that uh, the, the, the country has a human spirit which, which provides such developments in industry, agriculture, and science and technology. We would like uh, people who are visiting Belarus to see that we are friends and we have uh, a lot of opportunities to do business and to do cooperation. Next year, our two countries will mark 30 years uh, anniversary of establishing uh, diplomatic relations between the two countries. It's quite a round figure, and uh, the, the United Arab Emirates were among the first to recognize the young uh, Republic of the Lord 30 years ago. Uh, we expect to promote our country as a uh, highly developed science, universal science. And we work uh, with some countries in the region, with Saudi Arabia, and we hope to uh, establish this kind of cooperation with the Emirates. So I hope those things will uh, be supported by a successful uh, participation of the Rosemary's.